and welcome my fellow YouTubers, subscribers, followers, friends, and other tarot readers. And check out your cards I'm going to use for your readings, my Pisces. Guess what? And it's your reading for the first to the... Not even for the first to the 15th. For the entire month. For, for you, my Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. So let me tell you about the spread real quick. First card, first week. Second card, second week. Third card, third week. Fourth card, well, you get the idea. So are you ready? You better be. Let's do this. Come on, Pisces. Let's do it. Come on. Let's give me good stuff. Come on, Pisces. Give me the good. Give me the good. Come on, Pisces. Let's do this. Let's do this. Come on. Give me the good. Give me the good. Come on. Let's do this, Pisces. Let's do this. Are you ready for it? All right. Let's do this. First week, second week, third week, and fourth week. The first week is Ten of Pentacles. You're going to be happy. You're going to have a family, like a family reunion or something like that is going to happen. Or already has happened. I can't really tell, but a family reunion has happened in the first week. It's going to happen in the first week of March. All right, my Pisces. All right, now let's see car number two. Which is the week two with the moon. It will have mystery. And this is your card, Pisces. A card of fear. A card of deep, dark secrets. Before I continue, I need to clarify this. What are these fears? What are these fears? What are these fears? It is Knight of Cups. The fears that are bringing in opportunity if you overcome them. Alright, Pisces? Alright, right, 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 right. Card number three is Six of Swords. You're moving on, you're moving forward, you're moving towards something, you're moving towards a big opportunity, a big goal, a big place, a big new world for you, Pisces. That's amazing, amazing, I, if I do say so myself. All right, Pisces? All right, and now are you ready for card number four? Card number four is Hanged Man. A card of Neptune and in turn another card of Pisces, which is a card of not not in stock, but seeing things in a new perspective. Like la la la, I'm walking. Ooh, the world is so different when you look at it upside down. The buildings are in the sky. The sky is the ground. Everything's different. All right, Pisces. All right. Now are you now? Let's take out your oracle card. Come on, Pisces, come on, give me the good, give me the good, come on, Pisces, hold it, hold it, hey, come on, Pisces, give me the good, give me the good, come on, Pisces, come on, let's do this, let's do this, let's do this, super science talent, come on, let's do this, Pisces, come on. It is, this is not for you, this opportunity is not for you, it's for someone else. So if you see an opportunity, and you see it very clearly, it's not for you, because it will be, because it will come close to you, the opportunity, if it's for you, it will come close to you. If you see another opportunity on someone else's plate, but if you see a leftover carrot on someone else's plate and you love carrots, it's still not for you unless you ask. And no means no, Pisces. All right, hubble hubble hey. All right, now are you ready to see what your angel has to tell you? Okay, the angel of decision is telling you this. The angel of decision is telling you, unlikely, what you're hoping for is unlikely. It's a, There's a chance of it happening, but the chance of it not happening is great. So, and majority wins, if I, if I have to say so. All right, my Pisces. All right, look all right. The angel of overall is, the angel of the messages tells you, if you believe, if you constantly manifest it every night in your bed, if you keep manifesting it over and over and over, it is a chance of happening. And the angel of time is saying, telling you this. Take action on something. Make the first move, Pisces. Make the first move. So I hope you have a great, great, great March. Be for Rihanna. Ba 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 ba. Peace, peace, peace.